Hey Benji, Benji boy. Okay. The modern opponent goes back to E4. Played like this before. It's a very fitting song, by the way. This is how I feel about Title Tuesday. This is the typical setup. If your opponent castles queenside in the modern, you want to play c5. This is what I'm playing for. My opponent might go here or here, at which point total chaos will happen. Or they might play g4, but my setup is equipped to stop their attack because h5, g5, g5, h5. Come here, I'm gonna take. Yeah, I'll take with the pawn, but I like to take with the knight so that the rook open, rook stays open. Okay, that's interesting, but I think that's a little bit slow. Now I'm gonna go here, hitting this pawn. If my opponent puts the knight on g3, that actually gets in the way of those pawns. And I think it allows me to play knight g4, and as long as I can remove one of the bishops from white's position, I'm just doing very well. Queen a5, b4 is a possibility. I can take now, or I can wait there's any real advantage. I guess take, there's F take. Have to be ready for a counter attack. So let's just play queen b6. Waiting game. In fact, this, maybe I should have played it myself, but it's always a question, like, do you play h5 or not? Oh, I, big meaty dog. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go here. Is there a sacrifice? Did I blunder that? You know, it kind of looks like I did, but then at the end I have knight f2. Okay, that's, that's a move. Uh, I'm gonna take the bishop now, so I don't ever have to worry about any of that stuff. See, now if this takes, this structure looks really bad. The idea of d5 is to get me to commit to allow the knight to go to f5, which does not look very pleasant at all. Queen takes, I was just gonna go here. And once I can get a queen trade, I think I'm just gonna win. I think I'm just gonna have a long-term endgame advantage of the bishops. Uh, that's... I don't think that changes anything. I couldn't take the queen because pawn takes knight was a Zvichenzug in-between check. Now the bishop is gonna move and I was just gonna play like king e7 and vibe. Now I never gave up the f5 square, the f file is open, and I think I just have the better position. Um, yes, I can. should play for d5, but I don't really want to. Four, but then at h4. Maybe a5. Tough to say. Tough to say what the best plan here. I don't want to trade too many pieces. Let's just slowly figure things out. Let's let my opponent self-destruct.
Not a bad move. Maybe, maybe, maybe now I can start attacking. That or more. I'm targeting F2. King. This. In. Still a big battle ahead. E5? I just can't beat anybody today. Very sweet. Insane. What am I doing? Why am I why am I doing that? Why did I play that? D5. Maybe I run that way. <laughs> no, I don't. It's rook a7, rook a3. What the heck, man? So crazy. How is this possible? This is nuts. Do I have to play the 50 moves out? I kind of just want to make a draw. the last time Benji played on my lap I also made a draw nice one and a half wow 